So Skip brings a certain level of enjoyment into everything he does. He leads each and every day, not for himself, but truly for our residents, for our staff, um, and for his mission. I've worked with Skip for over 20 years, and um, he just makes a room light up and makes others light up in that room because of his nature. I think it's his laugh and his infectious personality to just make you want to have a great day and be happy. Very humble, very humble gentleman. I'm very fond of Skip, yeah. We all are, as a matter of fact. He's not a shy person. He's very, um, very social. He just wanna, you know, make every sure that everybody is uh, happy around him, and, and uh, that, you know, he make everybody feel comfortable. And you can tell that he right away he's a very caring uh, person. And uh, you know, you can tell that he lives, breathes uh, what he does here, and he loves it. Well, I just thought he was very friendly, and made me feel at ease coming here. Most mornings, a lot of mornings, on my way to breakfast, I would see Skip, and he's so cheery and happy that it put me in a good mood for the day. <laughs> well, it's notorious at Greenpoint that I like to have a good time. So the night that we were doing the, the wine painting thing, he was the bartender, and he greeted me personally. And I, I just know that he, my husband had recently passed away, and he just knew how to, to low-key that, and yet he understands what's up here with me. Everybody knows Skip, and everybody loves Skip. At the Hearth on James, he dressed up as Santa Claus, and my executive director there dressed up as Mrs. Claus, and just, he'll do whatever to get a smile out of somebody um, and, and really make it memorable. Skip knows everybody is held in very high regard and incredibly passionate. I mean, he's, he's doing what he was born to do, without a doubt. Skip has been an asset to this team, and I am truly honored, on behalf of Hearth Management and everyone here today, to be honoring you with our Gentum's National Hero Award. <laughs> We have to be positive, we have to be inspirational. And I wanna know that I've made them smile or a kind word. You know, when they go to the hairdresser and they feel good, you look great today. And it puts a smile on their face and that's what's important to me. You know, I hug, I, I'm a big hugger. So, you know, and I think that's important and it shows them who I am, because I'm a real person. What you see is what you get. I may say th crazy things, I may trip, I may fall, you never know but I am who I am, so, and they know that about me, I'm real. And I'll tell you, some of the amazing people that we've had in our communities, from lawyers to doctors to just farmers, it's amazing to listen to their stories and listen to who they were and what they were. And if it wasn't for them, we wouldn't have what we have today. And I think it's a wonderful thing that he has the chance to get this award. It's a wonderful place, and people like Skip make it uh, pleasant to be here. People become friends here. We've actually had couples that have moved in that have gotten married. We've had weddings for them. You never know. You know, love is always there. Every day I come in, I love what I do and I love our residents and our communities. It's kind of emotional because so many of our residents today, families are so busy, they don't have anybody. Sometimes we're all we have. I have residents to this day who call me to say good night. I often say at night, when I say good night to people. It's so nice to have someone to say good night to.